my name is Dr. Paul Kamitska. Uh, I'm the hospital epidemiologist at New Hanover Regional Medical Center in Wilmington, North Carolina. Uh, the question is, how do we protect ourselves from uh, the uh, swine influenza uh, H1N1 virus? And the answer to that is, uh, uh, first of all, uh, hand washing, uh, very important. Uh, not only using soap and water, but also uh, making use of alcohol gel hand sanitizers, which are effective. Uh, second is uh, avoiding contact with uh, people who appear to be sick with respiratory symptoms, uh, fever, cough, aches. Uh, in addition, uh, trying to avoid crowded areas if possible. Uh, when you're in a crowded area, uh, that's where uh, influenza may be transmitted uh, more easily. Uh, you have to be aware that, uh, for example, doorknobs uh, or any uh, uh, items that people are touching could potentially be contaminated with the flu virus, uh, again underscoring the importance of, of hand washing. Uh, so once again, in terms of preventing uh, the swine flu uh, infection, uh, the key things are hand washing uh, as well as uh, avoiding contact uh, with people who appear to be sick. Uh, and uh, uh, just being cognizant of, of trying to avoid uh, crowded areas if possible uh, since uh, uh, there is an enhanced likelihood of transmission of flu in those settings.